Hey. Judge. So what's going on? I was the one that took Shamar in as been staying with me for six months. Right. So basically Shamar is getting on live. Well, basically how it started off, he gave my address to his so-called claim other auntie, but he made a mistake and sent it to my phone. Right. And with my picture, and I asked him, who are you sending this to? Right. So he said, I didn't give out your address. Yes, you did. So I screenshot the message and sent it back to him. Shamar played dumb and crazy like he know what the hell I was talking about. Like, why the hell is you giving out my address so my auntie can meet you? Anytime when Shamar wanted me to meet his sister, his real sister, I was going to meet his sister in a, a area, not at my house or at her house. When Shamar want to meet somebody, I take him to meet them. Not at my house. I have a grandchild. I have kids. Cause that's you don't just give. You just don't give people nobody address. When Sh Shamar been selling me, I feed Shamar. Shamar have a whole bedroom, a whole bathroom to himself. When Shamar clothes get washed, I wash his clothes. When Shamar need private, you know, deodorant, toothbrush, all that, I get it together for him. I didn't care what nobody said about Shamar. I judged Shamar off my own character because he was homeless. So I took him in to get him somewhere to stay for him to get on his feet. I was scheduling doctor's appointments, dentist appointments, orthodontist appointments, everything for him. I never gave Shamar a curfew, you no know, nothing. I was trying to help him get everything right. I told him to go back. He needed to apologize to a lot of people that he was cussing out, saying he was going to jump on. He was going to do something, too. It doesn't make any sense. But then he want to get on live and say, oh, I'm out here pulling out a gun. I'm going to call the police. Shamar, you must understand all the shit I know about what you did or what you got going on. It's ridiculous. Shamar never, I never asked Shamar to pay for no bill in my house. But to show his gratitude, Shamar could at least say, well, okay, we're here. Well, let me go take you to get something to eat. But he can go out here and go get hotel rooms with all these people, buy food, buy drinks. But you forget about the place where you lay your head. Okay. I never asked to pay my let light bill. No, none of that. Let me ask you this. So with that being said, maybe when he sent the address, do you think it's a possibility that he, because like, how did he, he send the address to you? But he sent it by mistake. I know that. But how did he send it? Like, he was like, this her address. And so he basically. Sent my, he sent my picture with the address below it and said, this her. Huh? Maybe he from from my yes. understanding. From my understanding, correct me if I'm wrong. The reason he sent it to her was well, sent it to you by mistake. But the reason he sent it to her was because his auntie wanted to know where he laying his head at, who he went for safety reasons. Why? Why is that the case now? He been living with me all this month, all this time. He I, never had no I issues. Do, I, I do agree with you on that. If nothing happened to you, to him within all of those months, I totally understand why that should have been a concern from day one. My point exactly. So Shamar being comfortable at my house. He walked through my house. He eat. When I go to the grocery store, I go buy groceries. Shamar pick up his snacks. He pick up his drinks. He pick up whatever he want about the store and I pay for it. He don't pay for nothing. He don't. And nothing. I'm, he don't. They like, this lady right here, y'all, she, she a real MVP, all bullshit aside. This lady helped him with everything from just everything. Helping him getting bookings and shit like that. This lady has stepped in when nobody had his back. She came in and took over and helped the man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to call him and talk to him about that because I don't like this. Because at the end of the day, this lady helped him. This lady really helped him. All bullshit aside, this lady came in and took over. You know what I'm saying? When he couldn't go to my house, when he couldn't go to Auntie Kiki's house, this lady right here said, you know what? You can come over to my house. And she let him, he ain't had to pay no rent, no bills, no gas, no nothing. He had a free ride. All he, all she wanted was the respect of not her address getting shown. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to talk to him about that because that's fucked up. You don't do people like that who got your back. Because you, you Auntie Kiki won't let him stay there. Now I see why. No, Shamar can't stay here. I been told him that three years ago. Well, Auntie Kiki, he always made that clear. He can't come late. Right. Yeah. I just... I could say Shamar has been doing so Man, much great. Shamar not get along. Just sound like we is. Because if he stay with me, he might be in the same predicament that, that, that her and Shamar in now. That's, That's why he can't stay with me. That's respect. But I had on a straightened arrow where he was going back, okay. where he was fixing me. I was the one who told him he need to go back and apologize to a lot of people that he did stuff to. I was doing that. 
I was I was encouraging him every day. I was getting Shamar in counseling. I was doing that. Not nobody. Else. I'm trying to get him together to where he can branch off and do his own thing for him to save his money for him to get his own place. You don't get on live and lie about somebody and say, oh, me and my son going to do X, Y, Z. I pull out my gun. Also, Shamar, hold, stop with them lies. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The gun situation wasn't true? No. No. He lied. He straight up lied. He sure did. And then he got his friend Trez texting my phone. Why did you say to give what out Trez, my number? What I don't give out no from? information. What Trez come from? You became out the, out, the, out the bricks of the woods. I'm telling you, that boy text my phone. Oh, him and Trez met friends? I, I guess so, but this is the thing, though. I told Shamar earlier today, you can come get your stuff. I'm going to sit it outside so I don't understand why the Trez was calling my phone. But well, Shamar, you just well, told Shamar, me he was broke. Shamar, said Shamar just told me he was broke. I was taking Shamar to the Social Security office and to the DMV so he can get his new Social Security card and his new, you know, ID card. He said he had no money for the live. I'm running Shamar around. I took off work today so this boy can get his stuff. I miss my fucking money. My money. Well, he, I have been this a couple of times. He said you're not letting him get his stuff. And then he tried to get his friend to come get his stuff from now. Okay, so how about we just do this? Drop his stuff off at um, drop his stuff off at Auntie Kiki house, and he can go to Auntie Kiki house and just pick it up. That's even, that's even better. So y'all won't have no, y'all won't have no type of yeah. seeing each other. It just Honestly. leave it like that. You go your separate ways, and he go his separate ways. But I honestly say Shaman need to mean his differences with her. Cause she good people seem like no, from what I. See. Definitely, definitely good people. Like how he, because how I met her is through Shamar, because he was talking good about her. He was just like, you know, da 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 da. So I, I'm thinking that this, this somebody good. And me, her, me, her talk on the phone. Like she have helped. Let's be real. It was times that Shamar blocked me for no fucking reason, and she checked the phone. Like she called Shamar. Like what's going on with you and Tommy? It was time that she put me on Shamar on the phone with each other to figure out what's going on with us. You know what I'm saying? On some gene with shit. So to hear this going on now, it's like damn, that fucked up because this lady had your back and she had my back also. You know what I'm saying? On some real genius shit, telling me, showing me how to get jobs. You know what I'm saying? She do so much shit. You know what I'm saying? Show him how to get his money back going. It's just a lot that she done done. It's like, damn, it's fucked up that this shit going on now. Because this lady's a real MVP, and I'm going to keep it real. Out of all the people, Shamar been around, even me, this lady came in and did what the fuck she's supposed to do and, and took it far than where it went. Because let's be real, Shamar, when he, before he left me, he wasn't really making no money. This lady came in and helped him make money. And I'm just being real. I'm I shouldn't call shit. I'm be a real motherfucker. This lady did her job. So I. But it's fucked up how it's going. Does it hurt? Yeah, it hurts. It hurts bad. I'm sorry. It do hurt. I know it hurt. It hurt me too, but you know you can't do nothing but love the man. You know you gotta realize, like I tell people that he lost a lot of people in his life. So when we try to come in, he he don't know what real love is. So when y'all try to show him love, he might say he love you. But in reality, he don't know what real love is. So, but that's sometimes you just gotta pray about it and let God because, handle it. That's because he not. I heard a lot of people ain't been hurt so much. Yeah, before. so it's like it's like two things play a part in different situations. Like he been hurt and he also hurt people. So that's why I just tell people just pray about it and just you know whatever God want to happen is gonna happen. Right. Don't let, let that shit get to you or don't let you know let the situation be be a falling out or be our worst situation. Because there's better shit going on, and at the end of the day, just go your own separate ways. You go successful young lady. You got so much shit going on. You got grandbabies and stuff. Don't even let this shit entertain you. You not even like, this not even you. This not no person. You, you don't do this shit on the internet. So don't even let, don't even let this man get you to the point you're like, you on the internet. He's the one who took it to and the I, internet. He, I know he that. To the, and I don't understand why, and I don't even buy, I don't even do social media. Like you don't. That. You really I don't. don't. And why people, why are people saying that, oh, I'm doing this for clout. I could have been got clout from Shamar. I don't want no fucking clout. For what? I'm going to get my clout when I open up my law firm. You understand? Right. I don't need no clout from him. Oh, I'm going to get my clout. Oh, I'm a lawyer, man. Make sure you get me a job. Girl, you've been saying you're a lawyer for how many years now, girl? You need to stop letting go. <laughs> Anybody who knows me know that I work for <laughs> Nah, for real, though. But, Auntie, don't let this get to you, man. I just don't put, put y'all in my business. Don't, nah, that's don't, real. That's real. Yeah. I don't beg. <laughs> I don't like to see I don't like to see people homeless. I don't like to see people struggling. And at the end of the day, I will help anybody. If I got it, I'm gonna help because at the end of the day, that's why I'm an Eastern star. And that's what I mm -hmm. 
being. We do that. We do genuine things. And she I was trying to get be. him, you know, where he needs to be. Shamar, Shamar don't want no help. And I've been trying to help him. He was getting on a straight and arrow. Don't get me, don't get it twisted. He was because I would ride him every day. But when he I, but did, can I say, do you think I was, do you think honestly is somebody in his ear telling him to leave you alone? Like, you know, it could play a part also. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's somebody who you're around. It could be that kind of situation, you know what I'm saying? He probably don't want to do it, but it's somebody who he around probably like, oh, she, why the fuck she questioning you about, you know, where you went and stuff like that? It might be somebody in his ear. And so that's what I, I say. Don't Sometimes you got this. I don't, that's no, the but, thing. I don't question but, Shamar where he at. I just check but, on Shamar like, hey, are you okay? And then I ask him if he don't come home, uh, you know, about 12 o'clock because I go to sleep because I have to go to work. I'll be like, hey, are you coming back to the house? Sometimes he won't even respond back. So I just go to sleep. Mm -hmm. And I just kind of stay up and down mm -hmm. just to hear my phone ring in case, you know, he need to get in the house or in case yeah. he need a ride. That's the kind of person I am. When he need a ride, I don't ask him for no gas money. Uh, I go take him wherever he needs to go. I don't ask him for nothing. Say what? He, he go right here online. Jamar, stop, man. Chill out, man. Don't do it like that, Jamar. Call me in, but what you say, Jamar? Jamar to come to the lab. Tell her, don't do, don't no, do her like that. I don't give a fuck. Because she getting mad at me for no reason. She mad because of stuff that I sent the, I send the address to my real biological auntie. Didn't I just say that, y'all? Why is he sending my address out after you don't supposed to send nobody address out after he been asking me, can somebody come to my house and pick him up? So why would you just up and just send it to somebody? That's dead wrong. I don't send no address to where he's at or what he got going. That's just wrong. I did ask you. No, you didn't ask me. Shamar, stop fucking lying. You ain't asked me shit. You just sent that shit. I don't give a damn. I don't know her. I don't give a fuck. I don't know her. You didn't ask me shit. You fucking asked me. You didn't ask me. You sent that shit. I don't send nobody shit about you. Nothing. You don't send my shit. I got kids. I got fucking grandkids. The fuck is wrong with you? Okay, but I'm gonna Okay, Shamar, you always say you're gonna take everybody to court. You're gonna beat everybody ass. You're gonna send everybody to jail. Okay. And that's why you keep getting karma happening to you because of the same shit you do. No, it ain't, baby, because you had a whole place to stay for six months, sweetheart. I don't have to keep arguing with you, Shamar. And I don't know why you be having the attitude. That's why I get away from you because of some fact. I know for a fact that you be pissed off and you be mad. I don't know what I did to you because I ain't did nothing to you. Oh yeah, when you had a, uh, let me ask you this. So how the fuck I'm still blocked? So what do you uh, talking about somebody? We still waiting. We still waiting. You want somebody to feel sympathy for your ass to see you some fucking cash out and you need to fucking stop? Damn, my bed too, sister. <laughs> <laughs> tomorrow, got, tomorrow got some money. Tomorrow, I wants some no, tomorrow, I don't want no clout. If I want a clout, baby, I could have been got clout. Tomorrow, I don't want no clout. No clout. Come That's why I'm saying I don't want some clout. Because the, the people want to know about these threats, Jamar. Come up I want to know I got blocked. I'm always leading in the blind. Tomorrow, he's not going to unblock Tommy. All he's going to do is keep oh. talking inside the comments. That's oh, all he's going to keep doing. He's going to block me now because um, he's talking in the comments. I can see his comments. So he blocked, he unblocked me. So you got to just add him. <laughs> I did. He declined. Hey, Ken. Jamar. What? Ken, you talk about Ken or Barbie? What? Yes. Hey, he's still homeless. Girl, you mess with everybody. You mess with <laughs> Ken and Messy Dog. He's still homeless. <laughs> no. no. Girl, would you, let me ask you this. Don't do Ken like that. Don't do Ken like that. He's homeless now. You going to take him in? <laughs> <laughs> would you no. take him in? No. Because if you're homeless, I need you dirty, bitch. He's going to do you dirty. Yeah, kid gonna do you dirty. You think Shamar did you dirty? Kid gonna do <laughs> Listen. <laughs> oh, Listen. Shit. Give Ken, give Ken a place to stay. I, I, I give it a Ken Ken just need a little help too. Uh, okay. uh, we stand together. We stand together. Ken needs some help. Yeah. All we need, all Ken needs a place to stay. Please. I guarantee you gonna make some dirty ass bitch. I'm not mother. Yeah, that faggot ass hoe since that is sissy. Know what the you fuck to do. Bitch, drop down and drop dead like a fly. Bitch, get what? the eagle on, and I don't give a fuck about what that hoe what? talk about. What? Hey, you doing? Hey, how you doing? Hey, Ken. Hey, boo. 
You okay now? Yeah, I'm chilling. I'm just chilling. I'm just watching this whole shit. You know, I don't get in the midst of other people's shit, but I love to watch, you know, other people's bullshit. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> um, I hey, Kiki, really Kiki, Kiki I know you're not on that, uh, on that phone over there. I'm not trying to act like y'all know who this is. Hey, Kiki. <laughs> but I know your goddamn big dude ass. <laughs> what don't have to percolate, kids. Huh? Go don't have to percolate. Girl, this is not about I don't Miss Kim. This is about so, Yeah, it's crazy because y'all got the jealousy man no. up here. So, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> who? Who jealous, Tommy? Who? Who jealous? I ain't talking about. Oh, no, Ken said that he talked about Tommy. Don't put time. words in my mouth, Theodore. I That's ain't never been jealous of not near bitch. That's not what I said. I said y'all have the gelatin man up here. Who is that? You. Girl. <laughs> oh, Lord, have mercy. He got the little shit thing. Y'all got the real gelatin man. Oh, he got the real gelatin man. He ready. Mm -hmm. What's up, Miss Kim? He ready. <laughs> Okay, now court is in session. <laughs> what? What? Could I? I get could, up, could I come? I gotta answer more. Could I just go to my place and come live with you and eat for free for six? I gotta months? answer more. Huh? Huh? Could I get rid of all my stuff and um come um stay with you for six months? You gotta ask you more, y'all. Damn, that's how you do that. Mm -hmm. I got to ask you more. Damn, I don't even know how you do the damn lot of shit. Damn. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. Ain't, ain't, oh, ain't oh. they friends? I'm saying, ain't they say friends? Oh, I don't know who are they friends is. Hey, how you know how to do all that? That's how you do all that. Do it, do it again. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, how you do that again? What's up, man? What's up, people? It's time to go. You won't come back. Yeah, Ken, no, Bob got me blocked, so when he came up here, he dropped me. Yeah. Mm hmm. But yeah, don't let this shit get to y'all. We got so much going on. It's going to be 2024. Uh, yeah, add Trez up here because I want to know what his smoke is. Add Trez up here. Add Trez up here because I want to know what's going on with him. The one that takes you on the phone. Yeah, add him. I told him he could have called my phone. He kept texting. I don't do the texting. You do the pulling up, don't you? No, he could have picked up my phone and called me instead of doing a little texting. So let me let me talk to her real quick. Can y'all hit me? Mm -hmm. Hey, Miss Tiffany. Um, I thought, hey. Shabar, Shabar, Shabar. I thought Shabar was coming up. That's the only reason why I came up. Girl, girl. It was. Time is, shut your ass up, man. <laughs> I'm going to get to that in a minute. I'm going to get to that in a minute. What? But, but Miss Tiffany, um... Yeah, you was you was most definitely right. Um, he should never gave you his number. He should never gave me his your number. But I did tell him let me talk to you because I'm like, well, if you keep arguing with her, she probably she probably ain't gonna hear what you gotta say. So let me try to talk to her and TK get your stuff. So that's why I text you. So I apologize on my behalf. But under that, you did good. He said that you took care of him. So yeah, I give you your credit. But under that, you're good. I don't have no problem with you. I just want to get his stuff. Kiki. But Tony, why mm -hmm. you didn't tell it later? How she more get out? Oh, she said she got nothing to do with that shit. Uh-uh, I just want to know. She said she got nothing to do with that shit. Kiki, I want to know why the hell you didn't tell. Hey, excuse me, Millet, I don't know you, but I just want to know. Can you please forget your mark car? It finna be cold as a motherfucker out there. That motherfucker gonna have icicles on his motherfucking ass. If you been letting that motherfucker stay with you for six months, he could have offered you a dollar. Right. So, you right. If he come to you and he apologize from the bottom of his heart, cause we don't want to see that superstar home. You know what I'm saying? Can you please let him come back if he apologize mm -hmm. you on your phone? He need to do something, but the thing is, what I don't appreciate is he came to social he, media with it, and I don't do. Social I don't media. know if you if you've been watching him, you can see he burns his bridge with everybody. 
He burnt the yeah. bridge with Shakana. He burnt the bridge with his so-called friend Simon. Don't, don't say no so-called oh, boo. My okay, name is Simon. Okay, 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 Simon. okay, he burnt the bridge with his friend Simon. Okay. And he burnt this bridge with Auntie Kiki with the little he tried to let the little homely boy come stay over there and so, stuff. You know what I'm saying? He 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 burnt he burned the bridge with everybody, his sister, everybody. But it's getting cold out there, and we were feeling sorry for him when he was staying down there in the in, in the But you know what's so crazy? I found so crazy is you got so much to say about he can't him come stay all, with you for me. But you never so, let him stay with you though. He can't he been you burning bridges know, with you, me. For some reason He's you never let him come stay with you though. I got boys over okay, here. So they, I got they boys. Try, they can change him to be a boy. No, what the no, hell are we talking about? Can you can't change? You can't change nothing like that you, right now. So okay. Yeah. Because like, when, when he when he around my son, he act like a man. So he can change to be a man around your baby. You should your be having your son around him. No, he don't be around him. But when he been like when I had my car and I was dropping him off at his grandma's house stuff. You said that wrong thing right now. For having your son around something like that right now. What but what I'm saying, he can't come stay with me. So I ain't listen. That's out of the picture. Okay. That's fucked up, okay. so, yeah, You probably be here, auntie. Fuck that. I, you remember with the KFC shit? Huh? Uh -uh. You remember what happened in KLC? I really don't. Okay. You gotta remind me. All right, well, you remember them folk ran up in the KLC. He been burnt the bridge with me. He can't never come stay with me. He couldn't even come stay with me before the fame. He used to try to come over my house all the time, but he can't come over there. But, Miss Lady. Yes, ma'am. Can you please forgive Shamar? Cause it's gonna get real, real cold out like there. No shame. For the, for the next couple months. Oh, you made a look at him. What type of look did you make at him? What attitude did you have? And what car win? Shamar. Hey, girl, look like she was like, I ain't When did this happen, Shamar? I wanna know when this happened, Shamar. He still can't answer. When did this happen, Shamar? She talking about the same song to Methodon. Yeah, so when is it? When is it? When is it? Do it, Messy Dog. I'm the one who made him to make peace with Messy Dog. Oh! I was the one who made him to Messy Dog. That drama, that drama, that drama. I'm the one who made him to make peace with everybody. Instead of getting up and saying, I'm the one who made him to make peace with everybody. I'm the one who made him to make peace with everybody. I'm the one who made him to make peace with everybody. His drama down with everybody. I was the one doing that. I was the one who was telling him everybody he needs to stop cussing everybody out. I did that. Not him. You know, other than that, he would have been saying the popping out shit. But he said that. He talked about everybody in my house. Other than that, everybody he didn't talk about. But Mister Dog, not nobody that means no differences with. So my question is, why did I get blocked? He asked him why did I get blocked? Cause I don't remember what the hell I did. <laughs> I don't. I honk him up because all he oh, do is. I want to know why the fuck I got blocked. He blocks everybody for no reason at all, and the only reason why I tried to meet everything with him and Mr. Dog because he said he didn't understand why Mr. Dog kept picking with him. So I said, "Why don't you sit up here and mend everything with Mr. Dog?" That's why I said that. Mm. So, Judge, when you gonna fight Mr. Dog? Girl, she ain't know where to be. I would never fight him. He's beneath me. Oh. Mm. Never. But I have somebody do something to him before he. What? I don't find <laughs> beneath me. Oh, oh, Lord. Y'all don't need to be out here fighting uh, tomorrow. And I probably need to get out here and go make your money. Maybe I wake up to luxury every morning. I know that's right. Make that money, baby. Mm -hmm. Judge, make money. I see you, you too, Judge. Mm -hmm. What you say, boo? I be watching you too. What else, Shamar? You and Abby. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Y'all be at the club. I saw y'all at the club. I was like, look at them all. Hold on. And at what? the funeral. You think you can all. You think you can. You said what, Shamar? Give Shamar and y'all out the doorway. You said who? who? Do you think. I said she blocked me. Tell me you blocked me. I can't see your life. No. Oh, man. Yeah, are you alive? Yeah. You are your life, right? Yeah, on the Kiki two for one page. Yeah, she blocked. You not? I ain't touch no phone. You ain't blocked. I ain't touch no phone. Yeah, it probably because he got me blocked. Oh, oh, because you got, you got, you got, you got tell me, you got tell me blocked. Cause tell me on that. That's why. That's why we can't get on. Okay, hold on. Let me go. Let me go. I'll block somebody. Okay, cause I know she know she like that. Tommy, I'm on block too. Tommy, I'm about you. 
Tommy ain't said nothing about you. That's no problem. You listen to too many motherfuckers. Said, Tommy ain't said shit about you. What happened? He said people telling him that uh that you talking about him. Yeah, come on he, up here. They come, come, come on up here. Come on up here. I keep telling about that same shit. He need to stop that. Okay. He listens to too many fucking people. Feel about this situation. Come on. Come on up here so we can talk about why you got me. Come on, me. Auntie Kiki. Oh. What? How you feel about this situation? Kiki ain't gonna feel ain't no type of way. Cause Kiki ain't got nothing to do with it. So she ain't gonna feel no type of way. Kiki work on the job. I never had nothing to do with that Period. shit. Right. And auntie, the other auntie, auntie don't got nothing to do with it either. So. <coughs> let this go. Yeah, you got them black time to get on the last one more. No, nobody's not teaming up on Shamar. Shamar, Shamar did this to himself. I ain't much in the blood. Okay. Having nobody even did nothing to Shamar. Shamar is the one who got on live and started talking about me for no reason at all. And I, why he took the social media, I don't know, because he know I don't get on there. <laughs> it is no reason for that. If Shamar had an issue with me, well, like I told him, if you got an issue with somebody, don't go on their live talking shit. Pick up your phone and call and talk to the person if they if they mean something to you, if they your real friend. That's some shit you don't do. But you gonna go on you gonna go on social media, Shamar. Let's be for real now. You gonna go on social media? But you but but you gonna go on social media and talk about somebody. Now y'all see what I'm talking about. Why don't you go on social media? 